Hello guys, um, <clears throat> today I sent the first stock picks to my subscribers, okay? So um, uh, I, I sent them uh, instructions what to do with the stocks and uh, for risk management and the other stuff. So um, uh, for those uh, who want to join uh, my uh, stock picks, uh, um, uh, alert please do just to to see where I am now yesterday and today you will see that the market is down okay all the market would you see that it's not that good but still today I find about uh, 15 to 20 stocks that they send to my subscribers okay uh, some stocks are 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 small like uh, twelve dollars fifteen dollars twenty some they are fifty or seventy some they are one hundred one hundred fifty because you know my subscribers for these stock picks uh they have different accounts some they have big accounts and some they have very small accounts so i'm trying to whatever i found like a uh, price range i will do even if it is four dollars five dollars seven dollars if i find i will put okay but uh, understand that it's not uh, each day you find these stocks okay it's not each day it you, you should search and whenever whenever i find good stocks i will try to uh, send them to my uh, subscribers uh you will notice also that these stocks uh, are from different industries okay so for example for me when i when i buy stocks i don't buy in the same industry all my money okay i will try to spread for example we have drug uh, industry uh we have banking industry we have uh, real estate industry we have a uh, uh, consumable uh, industry we have retail industries so there are there are so many industries so i will try to spread in order to diversify and this is when i talk before to you about uh what you call um um uh, industry rotation uh, that means that some industries are going up some industries are going down so for me i'm trying to sh to choose uh, those the only uh industries that that are going up only now any industry that goes down for from the resistance line i will not touch and i will not see and even when I search, I don't find these uh, stocks because they are going down. And my strategy is only with the uptrend. It means stocks that are going to do an uptrend. This is what I'm looking for. Either for short term, long term, or intermediate term. Okay? So, uh, whenever you buy this kind of stocks, what you should do next is put stop loss. Now, why? Because the stocks... Uh, some are going up and few will go down so we don't know so my strategy is based on probabilities it means that we don't know the future so we don't predict okay when we have signal we buy stocks okay so when we buy stocks we will see tomorrow at the end of the day around three o'clock you open your account and you check those who go up keep them those who uh, go to your stop loss or wherever, uh, you uh, just um, just uh, ignore them, okay? Ignore them because when they hit the stop loss, you will exit them and with a, with a minimum loss. And that is how we trade in the swing trading. It means uh, my own strategy, okay? Uh, for those who who haven't joined yet, if you have any kind of questions. Or you want uh, just to try to try at least one month uh, you get uh, four um, uh, stock picks alerts each week you get only you get one okay when I when I search whenever I find the best one I will I will uh, send it uh, to you and it should be around three o'clock okay because three o'clock you open your account you get the uh, stocks you choose one or two or three because they are ready made it means you shouldn't think a lot about this because my my strategy is based on price 
So if you are going to see what is this company, what they do, and a lot of stuff, you just waste your time. So you are not going with my strategy. My strategy is going with price. I'm not, I'm not worrying about which company. Uh, there are some companies that you find very famous. Okay, you find it very famous, and all the people know them. But there are some uh, some kind of uh, um, uh, stocks or companies that you have never heard of. That's why these companies they will never be advertised. Okay, these some co some companies you will never heard of because the news they give you always big companies and well-known companies. Okay, so. Um, for those who have joined my uh, subscription, stock alert subscription, uh, if you need help with uh, uh, with uh, stop loss, uh, please uh, try uh, and help yourself with my ebook, which is how to calculate stop loss, uh, ways and strategies to protect your trade. Okay, because stop loss protects your position not to lose too much. But you can't lose little, okay? This is this is part of the game. When the stock is going down and you have stop loss, sometimes it hits your stop loss and there is no other way out, okay? This is the market. But instead of losing too much, for example, if you put a, a, a 5,000 position and you lose 100, okay? It's better to, if you don't put stop loss, maybe you lose 500, 700, 1,000. You don't know what will happen in the day. So it's better to protect yourself. If you don't protect yourself, you will never be a swing trader or trader. Okay? This is not investing. Because in investing, you don't put a stop loss. But in swing trading and in trading, we, you must put stop loss to protect yourself. Okay? Because we are not saying one year. We are saying the second day, and then we will see. If the stock is going up, few days few weeks or few months we stay because the market is giving us money why because we are right okay when the stock goes up it means that you are right so you stay but if the stock is against you you are wrong and you you should never be stubborn okay you should exit with stop loss and find another stock okay so i put uh, a link uh, to my uh, to my ebook here uh, for those who want to uh, just to uh, purchase it uh, or to understand how we do this uh, stop loss, it is complicated. If you go online and you find people like uh, just make it easy, oh, just go here one dollar, two dollars. It's not okay. You when you read my ebook, you will understand that there are a lot of a lot of a lot of things that you should learn because it is not it is not only uh, sometimes a stock with twenty dollars, two stocks with twenty dollars, but when I put the stop loss, it will be different. It will be never the same. Now why? Because of other things that I explain in the e in the ebook. Second thing, it's you. Some people they like uh, more risk. Other people they like less risk. So you should choose your stocks accordingly. And this. I explain in my ebook uh, in plain text and with uh, charts and you can just practice and practice because what I'm doing here I am teaching you to learn swing trading my way in order to succeed you should practice and practice and practice it's not something that uh, uh, magic it's not magic in one day or two you become a professional trader you become a professional trader because you are disciplined and you take your um, what you call learning process seriously and you take trading as a business not as just fun you say oh i have to two thousand three thousand dollars i know yeah i just save them and let's play uh, with the stock market and see uh, what will happen as as many people they they send me emails like this uh, we will see what will happen now either you are doing business if you are doing entertainment it's okay, okay. You you want to lose this three thousand or five thousand? You do entertainment, and you give your money to other traders who are professional traders. It's okay, okay. It's your money. I I can't stop you from, um, uh, from uh, spending your money. You spend your money the way you want, okay. But serious traders, 
in order to build yourself and to build discipline you should always be disciplined one mistake that you do will cost you money and sometimes it's too much money let's say you buy a stock at 20 you don't put stop loss tomorrow there is bad news it goes to 15 dollars you will lose 500 dollars for 100 shares it's just because you don't put stop loss if you put stop loss you can lose 70 dollars 50 dollars 100 dollars that's it why you should lose too much and when you lose too much you can't make it at the end of the year you can't you can't make profit believe me either you are neutral or you are down your uh, big losses or even if you make money you make a very meager um, percentage like two percent five percent or seven percent or ten so you are not really making money you are just playing the whole year and doing nothing okay so uh, that's it for today if you have any question for those who have not subscribed to my uh, stock picks if you have questions just comment here or send me a private mes message my email is on the top of the of the top of the description that's it thank you very much and have a nice day